Hello, my name is Charlotte and I work for the Berkshire, Buckinghamshire and Oxfordshire Wildlife Trust, commonly known as Beebout. I'm an education officer. That means that I work with people of all ages to help them learn about wildlife and engage with nature. Here at Sutton Courtney Environmental Education Centre, we run school trips, family events, toddler groups and adult classes as well to help all ages to grow and thrive with nature. I love my job because not only do I get to spend time outdoors close to nature myself, but I also get to share it. The wonder and excitement on the faces of adults and children alike when they hold a newt for the first time or catch a dragonfly nymph in the pond, or just run through the long grass and feel the wind in their hair. This is something priceless and vital. At school, children are taught that humans need food, water, air and shelter to survive. Nature gives us all of these things, but she doesn't just sustain our physical bodies, Nature nourishes our minds as well. Today I'm going to show you a really easy activity suitable for all ages that can help us to take time to let nature into our minds and support our well-being. I call this activity a natural pause. You can do it almost anywhere outdoors. Choose a spot in your garden a local park, under a street tree, or perhaps on your local Beebout nature reserve. If you aren't able to leave the house, try it at a wide open window or door. Switch your phone off and sit or stand silently for at least two minutes. If you like, you can shut your eyes. Listen. Let your mind wander. Take a few deep breaths. Let your shoulders relax. Let the sensations of nature wash over you. Be still. Try to return to the same spot regularly and repeat the activity. See how what you notice changes. Try this with your children. It's surprising how much they can value the permission to just be still and the things that they notice for the first time. If you want, you can vary the activity a little. This can be very useful with children who appreciate a little bit more direction. Try changing your perspective. Lie on your tummy and watch what's going on in the grass. Lie on your back and look into the branches of a tree or watch the sky. Face a stone wall and take notice of the lichens, mosses and mini beasts. Explore your local green space, taking time to stop, look and listen. It only takes a moment for nature to touch your mind. All you have to do is open the door. 